Hello everyone, this is Ms. Mocha. I hope you're having a super blessed day. And I am here wanting to share my newest, newest, newest project with you. Now, I bet you're wondering, did she start baking? Because that looks like a parfait in the background. Did she start making desserts or something? Is she trying something different? Well, it is dessert and it's for the body, but it's for external use only because I have made strawberries and cream parfaits. Yes, look at these. I know they look super real and super edible, but they're for pleasure of the outside external use i love how these turned out they came out exactly how i planned i'm so excited i can't wait to sell these i can't wait to put them on the shelves at my shop these oh my gosh um these parfaits have um i was gonna just go ahead and use brown sugar but i have fun like doing all the work so i dyed um, regular granulated white sugar and I um, used brown and yellow micas and I took it from there. Um, I moistened them with, you know, my different oils to make that um, kind of that graham, graham cracker clumpy look that you usually put on the layers of a parfait and with some added touches, it came out like so. Like I said, I'm very, very excited. I made um, a variety of parfaits. Here you can see um, this one has the white cream with a layer of scrub at the bottom. And these parfaits will be coming with these cute little scoops. So you can pop the top and dig right in. Now, when I ordered the containers, I forgot to realize, well, I didn't forget to realize, that doesn't make sense. I didn't realize that they have holes on top because these are real parfait and dessert cups. So I just covered the top with another label and I'm gonna tape um, the other ones that are gonna be exposed as well uh, if they don't sell quick enough. But I think, I think and believe that's not going to be a problem. So let's see. Over here, I have an all pink parfait with a layer of scrub in the middle. And are you noticing those cute strawberries? Don't they look real? Well, I can't take credit for them as much as I want to. But these little soaps, I discovered um, the maker on Etsy. These are, um, it's Lee, Lee Soaps. You can go to um, her website. Uh, it's www.leesoaps.com, L-E-E, -E, leesoaps.com. I seen her soaps online and lost it because, you know, when I make my products, I do every step. But now that I see these little fruit soaps, and I know I can get the molds and do it myself, but I'm usually just doing liquid soap or, you know, my shower gel or my bar, my bath bars. Um, and I also have molds to do round soaps. And I get into the, you know, different types of soap, different fragrances of soap. But I like to support other businesses as well, just like I've been supported. So... Um, I contacted her. She sent these right away. So if you guys just, you know, if you're interested in getting the soaps alone, I will include the link, um, down below. And like I said, these soaps are so real looking. I love them. They, they go, they add the perfect touch to these parfaits. Um, I'm going to be doing more parfaits very soon. I found some other soaps. Um, I'm not going to even tell you. 
I'll just let you see it because I'm just so excited. I want to tell you, but oh my goodness. Um, with Valentine's Day right around the corner, I just thought this would be so appropriate uh, to make something with pink and red and just to be more festive. So these are my strawberries and cream parfaits. Let me give you a close up. You can see the cute labels. And here, these boxes are ideally for my candles, my um, four ounce candles. Uh, I can get an eight ounce candle in there as well, but the parfaits fit inside perfectly. So I'm really excited about that. Only thing, because of the dome top, the top of the box doesn't shut completely, but it's, it's reassurance that the uh, parfait container will be enclosed if I'm packaging them and um, getting them ready to sell. I can just put them in here and then put them inside another box or container and take it from there. Well, I'm so excited, you guys. I hope you're just as excited when you see these. I think they're adorable. I know these are going to sell fast. Um, I'm also doing pink sugar parfaits. No, it's not something that you would think is edible. So I'm going to have a little more fun probably with the um the fruit soaps. But I'm going to um build up my collection of um my inventory of different fruit parfaits. But I'm going to also offer the whip soap some, you know, without any, uh, anything. And you can still get your smooth whip soaps. Like I said, you can, they come in a lot of different fragrances. Um, the same fragrances I do my body butters in, basically. Um, you can get your exfoliating whip soaps. You can get the layers of, um, you can have them layered just like a parfait or I can blend the scrub into the whipped mixture and you can enjoy it as a shaving cream, as an exfoliant, as a cleanser, all of the above. This stuff is just wonderful. It's so cute. You know, you want to use it, but I'm just looking at them and I'm like, oh my gosh. And then the little scoops are too cute. They, oh, I love these little scoops. They're just, look at these. I love these little acrylic scoops. They're so cute. And they're the perfect height. They're the perfect size for my little um, dessert cups. So, yes. These are my strawberries and cream parfaits. Like I said, I'm going to be doing um, different kinds. And I'm going to be also um, jarring them up if people don't want them served like a dessert. Here I just have a... Let me put this over here. I have a... Um, jarred strawberry uh strawberries and cream whip this is the soap there's no exfoliants in this or anything so this is how it'll look jarred and of course you can order it however you want it okay everybody and like i said i'm gonna include um i'm gonna include uh lee soaps the contact information down below in case you want to contact her her, she responded right away. I received these in the mail right away. They were delivered, I'm telling you, like less than seven days after I placed the order. And with this pandemic going on, that's really saying something. So thank you, Lee, for these adorable strawberry soaps. And thanks everybody for watching. Take care and God bless.